Uh, put simply, the red cross symbolises, uh, or just means, don't shoot. The symbol is intended to identify people that are protected by the Geneva Conventions, meaning they're not part of fighting, they're there to help. Even you know, during the times of armed conflict, when things are really, really bad, there is one emblem which can protect certain people. Australia is committed to preserving the integrity of the Red Cross and other distinctive emblem as they afford special protection to victims in armed conflicts. The Red Cross is protected by Australian and international law. My father was um, a, in a concentration camp and the Red Cross um, liberated him and members of his family. So really I wouldn't be here today and my children wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for the Red Cross. It's not a logo or a trademark. It symbolises the protection of people and facilities that are providing life-saving equipment and support during times of armed conflict. You enter quite a volatile place um, and this Red Cross distinguishes you as a non-hostile, a non-combatant, uh, having a non-combatant role. The people displaying that symbol, whether it's on vehicles or the symbol of the Red Cross is on their clothing, it means they're not part of the fight. I was deployed as a nursing officer in 2009 on Operation Padang Assist. An important part of the support during this operation was the internationally recognised Red Cross symbol worn by medical personnel. For those that work consistently with the protective nature of the emblem, they are to be respected and protected during times of armed conflict. You walk into a jail and you're wearing the Red Cross badge, the detainees know immediately, OK, this is a guy, this is uh, someone who belongs to an organisation we can trust. Any misuse of the emblem compromises its authority and its capacity to protect people during times of armed conflict. One of our greatest challenges is to ensure the integrity of the Red Cross emblem so it can continue to support and protect during times of armed conflict. Here in Australia, unfortunately, it's not uncommon to see misuses of the Red Cross. Uh, often pharmacies totally benignly will put up a Red Cross not even realising what they're doing or, or a medical facility. Sometimes you get more creative misuses, perhaps on a, a naughty nurse uh, outfit at a shop in King's Cross or perhaps um, uh, there was the schooner glasses uh, incident where Red Crosses were put on them. It's just a case of uh, informing and educating the community that in armed conflict these, these symbols, these emblems mean a lot and it's really important we don't dilute the, that meaning. How can you help? If you suspect a misuse of the Red Cross emblem, please contact Australian Red Cross. <laughs>